Hey guys, I want to talk to you today a little bit about kind of a, a funny wording of a very serious topic that I think you need to take into account in your lives. But the topic of the post today is dude breakups, as funny as that sounds. Now, I'm more or less talking to a younger class of men today. Uh, you know, I, I think that all of us as, as men, as we progress through life, we're going to learn this lesson the hard way. But I just want to put it out there for consideration by some of you younger guys out there. When you're, you know, if you're just starting your journey and you are still feeling out your way in the world and what type of person you want to be and what sort of trackway you want to go down in life, you know, let's just say whatever that means to you. One very important thing that is going to come into play and affect your journey and affect your trackway and affect your, your everything in this world is the people you choose to associate with. And very specifically for us as guys, we're, we're going to have tight friends of ours that are other males around us. And, and oftentimes, you're going to have friends in your life that you, you have known each other for a long time and maybe your interests were aligned in the very beginning, but over time, you know, every man is going to walk their own path in life. And some men that are close to you, that are around you, are going to choose to walk a different path in life than you are. And despite your best efforts to impart positive influence on them and despite your best efforts to to be true to yourself you're going to find these times when when your values and your morals and your integrity and all this kind of stuff is going to be compromised just by virtue of the fact that you continue rolling with these sorts of people in life these these men that that are choosing to go down a different track which you might perceive to be not the track you want to go down in life i.e they're doing things that you think are going to get you in trouble that are going to stray you off of this path of integrity. They're doing things that are shitty to other people in this world. They're doing things that are not, they conflict with your inner sense of what's right and wrong. And it's, this is one of the hardest things I've found as young, young men come up is that there's going to come a point in time where as sad as this is, you're going to have to separate and disband and make a break for the, from those types of people in your life. You're going to have to stop rolling with these guys that are maybe a bad influence, but are certainly have the possibility of dragging you down with them or taking you down a trackway in life that you don't want to go down. And oftentimes it's it, it can be one of the most difficult things to separate yourself from a person like this in your life who you've been very tight with for a long time. And it is like as funny as it sounds, it's kind of like a dude breakup. It's like a guy breaking up in the sense breaking up a friendship with somebody who they were tight with for a long period of time and having to do what they have to do for their own reasons deep down inside. But for the other person on the other side of the, the end of this situation, it's oftentimes very hard to understand why this person who's been your tight, good guy friend for a long time no longer wants to roll with you. And it's, like I said, there is this temptation. There's probably going to be a guilt trip that comes along with it. But this is one of the hardest things in life to do, guys, but it's it's one of those things that you're going to have to do as a man at some point. You're going to have to pick and choose those guys that, that you are going to continue to be tight with in your life and those guys that you are going to continue to devote your time with just in general because, like I said, so much of our livelihood and so much of the trackway and the, the path that we go down in life actually has to do with those we choose to surround ourselves with. So it's going to be hard to put distance you know, between these sorts of people in these sorts of relationships and this sort of regard at various points in your life. But it's something that you must do as a man. You have to walk your own track. You have to stick to your guns. You have to stick to what you think is right deep down. And if you see somebody that's going down a bad track, i.e. they're doing quasi-illegal activities, or like I said, you don't like the way they treat other people around them, or you don't like the way they're leading their lives, or you don't like any number of things that, that just don't jive with you deep down inside, it takes strength, it takes a little bit of courage, and it takes like going through this sort of hard situation, in other words, like kind of having this dude break up with another person and just making a definitive a definitive action and taking definitive steps to separating yourself from that influence and that person. It's a very hard thing to do. You probably care about this person as a friend, but you know, at some point you know, you're going to have to separate. And there's some people that will say, like, you should just stick by people like till, through the thick and the thin till the bitter end. And you should try to be there to help people. And you should try to be there to, to, to influence people in a good way. But guys, here's the reality. You're not on this earth to fix anybody else. All you're here to do is to be the best possible version of yourself that you can possibly be. You are here to walk 
the path that you were meant to walk. You are here to better yourself. And that might sound selfish. You can you can take that for whatever that's worth and you can agree or disagree with that, but that that is the truth that I've come to know. And part of part of doing just that, part of being true to yourself, part of living your best life, part of walking down that trackway of integrity and learning that is learning when to separate from these bad influences and not getting dragged down and not occupying too much of your life trying to to get this quote unquote friend to do the right thing that that doesn't want to wise up and that doesn't want to stay out of trouble that wants to keep like i said doing illegal things or doing bad things doing whatever these things are that's on them that's not for you to own for the entire time you walk this earth so yeah sure give them a little bit of time give them however much time you feel like you need to try to help try to be there but there there's going to come this certain point guys where you are going to have to separate and this is going to be difficult to break up those sorts of relationships in your life but i really believe it's something that you must do as a man at some point you're going to come to this crossroads it's not going to be easy but you have to do it you you cannot allow yourself to go down a track that you don't want to go down just because you're trying to hang in and stay in a relationship for any number of reasons okay it's a very difficult thing to do it's a challenge for you you're going to have to do this at some point, and it's probably going to be somebody that you really care about, but you've you've got to do this for you. You've got to do this for the sake of your life and your path and your learning while you're here on the earth, okay? All right, guys. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Talk to you soon.